My favourite definition of unity is the mathematical definition. And the mathematical definition of unity is a quantity known as one. Just imagine in a town where the church was known as one. What difference would that make to a town and a city? How would those outside the church see the church? Are we up for the challenge? Why is unity across church denominations important? I think we've got a watching world and they look on our disunity as something offensive and confusing for them. Our unity helps our mission. Unity across the church denominations is radically important because we're made to be one body. Not different, we're different parts, we're not dismembered, we're one body. When we work together, we're greater than the sum of our parts. We can achieve far more, we can help far more people. We can be Jesus to far more people across our town and our city. Unity across the church has to be an important issue because we too easily forget that this is God's church, not ours. It's us that puts labels on it. It's us that calls the church by different denominations. But actually, we need to focus on what we hold together. And it's his church and he's building it. I think unity amongst church denominations is really important because um, the church needs to be about diversity and embracing difference in people, not expecting people to be the same, but actually we're all unique. And I think if the world's seeing a diverse church that's united, I think it offers a bit of hope to humanity. Nobody has the full picture. Uh, everybody connects with people, different people in different ways. We can all learn from each other. An effective church is focused on Jesus, on Jesus' love, on Jesus' mission. An effective church is one that looks at Jesus' model and speaks about him and speaks about the truth of God but also acts within the community and shares that with others too. So an effective church isn't just what we do within the building on a Sunday, but it's what we all do throughout every day of the year in our working life, in our home life, on our street life. An effective church is witnessing and sharing the love of Jesus where people are at in a very real and very tangible way. There's a real power in being together and something very special when church leaders gather together and they stand together. They stand together in relationship, they stand together in prayer, and they stand together in looking outside of the church to see how we can impact the community. The future of the church is together. There is only one church, and it is that church that Christ is coming back for.